All right, hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna be showing you around my beauty room slash home office slash content creation space. I've had this space since roughly June when I moved from another unit in the building which was just a one bed, one bath into a one bed, one bath plus den. So I was able to transform the den into whatever space I wanted it to be. And I'm finally feeling good with how it looks because I actually just deep cleaned it this weekend. So I thought it was the perfect time to shoot this video. So if you want to see what my beauty room slash home office slash content creation space looks like, keep on watching. Oh, and disclaimer, I am filming this on a grip with my camera. Unfortunately, I do not have a gimbal stabilizer, so if the camera shakes a little bit, I'm sorry, I will do my best to keep it steady though. All right, so my beauty room is just to the right when you enter my apartment, so this is what it looks like standing right before you enter into it. And so just starting off to the left, this is where I keep all of my unopened products. I keep like samples in the top drawer. I'll pull it out guys samples and then I have makeup some skincare and then stuff to give away this is just stuff that I normally get from like subscription boxes that I haven't gone around to using yet but anyways all goes in here just because I have so much of it and I don't want to put it in my collection right away until I run out of things and can replenish and then on my walls I have some like sticky notes I have goals for myself as well as like video ideas that I want to film and work on, and then some miscellaneous camera equipment and perfume and makeup boxes that I thought were pretty, so I left them there. Oh, and that's my dog on the ground. Hi, Mac! Hey, buddy! Yup, it's time to go to bed, Mac. All right, so on, on this side, I have just like more random post-it notes. These are like affirmations for myself for why I got this space and just to keep myself positive and motivated when I'm working in here. And then I have a bookshelf. So I just have some random books on the top and notepads and notebooks that I use and some random papers I just need to sort through. And then I have all my nail polishes and nail and hand care on the second shelf because I love nail polishes. I've been growing out my nails since like September and I am completely obsessed with having polish on it almost all times and then I have my Starbucks tumbler collection on the bottom or part of it I just keep the studded ones in here and a few other ones and then over here I have just this set of drawers from Ikea so the first two shelves are not gonna open but this is like jewelry I don't normally reach for and then on here I keep like my miscellaneous equipment and accessories for like my phone and like Nintendo Switch and stuff. And then down here, I keep all of my content creation equipment, the smaller stuff like my white balance cards, memory cards, and then microphones and random cords. And then down here is just um, some bigger equipment like the camera bags and tripod adapters. And then miscellaneous laptop equipment and a DSLR camera down there. And then I just have some things I need to hang up in the corner a cork board and then a small tabletop studio and then this is where I work primarily so this is my work computer and my monitor and then I have a blue Yeti caster mic that I use to talk when I'm in calls or frankly I bought it to do like podcasting and other content creation stuff maybe streaming so we'll see and I also have like a little ring light just in case it gets dark in my videos and I want a bit more light on myself so people can see me more clearly. Sometimes I turn it on, sometimes I don't. And I have a printer just in case I need to print out stuff. Um, I used to ship a lot of stuff on Mercari and Poshmark so it's nice to have my own printer especially since I'm not in the office. And then in these drawers is where I keep my makeup collection so they're on either sides of the desk. It's a long desk. Uh, let me just open a few drawers. So this is just some eyelashes and then I like this drawer because this is face palettes and then I keep like all my single face products blush highlighter bronzer down here then beneath my desk I just have like a trash can and a paper shredder can't be too safe with like your information and sometimes I'll put post-it notes on my wall too of stuff that I need to get done for work but I'm trying to move away from that because post-it notes are chaotic and on this side I just have more makeup these three bottom drawers are actually all eyeshadow palettes and that's just kind of my miscellaneous palettes morphe palettes and then more palettes on the bottom and then over here this is where the fun happens. So this is where I film the majority of my YouTube videos. I actually keep all of my brushes on the desk as well as I have a vanity mirror and 
most of the products that I use on an everyday basis here. I thought I would get ready at my desk more because I thought it was long enough, but it's not actually long enough with the monitor I have for my work. So I just find it easier to move over here and sit and do my makeup and then also film. And then I have some stools there that I put out when I'm filming so I can sit. And if I'm filming with a friend, I have another stool for them to sit at too. And so just looking at what I have, this is where I keep all of like my essential products that I use in like almost all of my videos. Very disorganized. Trust me, I know. I need to get better organization for this. And then I keep some miscellaneous sprays. This is for like my piercings and then some setting sprays and makeup remover. And then like lipsticks and miscellaneous tube like products. And this is where I keep all my pencils, liquid liners, and some tools. And then all of my brushes over here. I like to keep my clean brushes in their own cups and then I put any brush that I've already used, whether it's super dirty, definitely have to wash, or I could use it again like over here, just so I'm not mixing my clean brushes with my dirty brushes. And then I also have uh, two soft boxes. I got these off Amazon and I have a ring light too that I set up to film. The ring light is from Best Buy. It is the Sunpack 19 inch. I believe and I will link it down below and it's really nice because you can adjust like the brightness and the warmth and then I just set my camera in the middle I'll show you guys on the side I set my camera in the middle and then I'll change like my settings and I'll be ready to film and then since I'm filming on a grip I can trigger the record button just sitting down from my spot all right that is it for this video I hope you guys enjoyed this tour of my space if you guys want to see any videos on like content creation how I get my ideas what equipment I use etc just let me know in the comments below and please don't forget to hit the like button subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and turn on the bell for post notifications and if you're new here hi my name is Valentina and I upload two to three times a week and I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye everyone.